this stuff where you're interleaving blockchain and AI at a more fine-grained level, this is why we really need Hyperon and Hypercycle to work together closely. And I mean, it's why we need Toda and Hypercycle in the first place, because with Singularity Net, I mean, we're already doing decentralized AI, right? I mean, we can take we can take Hyperon instances right now, we can put them on different machines and we can coordinate them with, 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 with Singularity Net. And I mean, it, it, sure. it works. It's certainly, it's certainly way better than deploying it all on AWS or, or, or on Google's, Google's compute cloud. On the other hand, there's a lot you can get with HyperCycle that you don't, that you don't get that way, right? So you, you can't scale down to having very small AI agents do operations on chain because if you're using Ethereum or even Cardano, which is better than Ethereum, if you're using these networks, the blockchain interactions are still slower and, and more expensive. You also don't have smart card language that can pass multi-party security or homomorphic in- encryption or multi-party encryption of various sorts. You don't have smart contract languages that can pass that through the smart contract from from one to another, which is what you get from integrating, you know, Rolang with hypercycle compute node with Toda files with with, with, with the Hyperon AI engine and, and its meta script. So you there's diff, what we what we have learned since 2017 when we launched Singularity Net is, you know, just decentralizing AI is good. It's it's it's, it's a big step forward, but you want to you want to boil the use of the blockchain and the use of strong encryption down more granular level to the individual function body inside your AI AI that's running into the level of a very small AI agent running running on chain. And I mean that's that's what Tufi and I were talking about in 2018 when we first started about the totality is near, right? When we first started talking about <laughs> bringing right. bringing Toda IP protocol together with with Singularity Net, and what we see now with this new architecture involving hypercycle compute node and how we weave it together with, with Hyperon and, and Rolang along, along, along with Singularity Net, NuNet and a bunch of other ingredients. We're seeing now how, how you actually do make the totality happen, right? I mean, it, it involved a bunch of new software inventions mm-hmm. along, along, along the way, but I mean, we're, we're, we're making, Quite a lot Any of directions. interesting technical, pro- making a lot of interesting technical progress here. I mean, along with all the business model innovation that Tufi and his colleagues mm-hmm. have been doing in in Hypercycle, which which is yes. helping bring in bring in revenue to push things forward. <laughs>